Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Gems of Knowledge. So I am back with another video on exercise 9.2 from the chapter mensuration of class 8. So I hope you remembered I have done with the first video which consists of 4 questions here. Today we are going to deal with the 5th question. Okay. So before starting the video make sure to subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell button to get the notification as soon as I post my new videos. So here the 5th question is given. The diagonals of the rhombus are 7.5 cm and 12 cm. Find its area. So the diagonals are been given so uh, first diagonal is 7.0 centimeter that is d1 is equals to 7.5 centimeter and d2 is equals to 12 centimeter so we are having the formula of rhombus that is area of rhombus is equals to half into d1 into d2 let us substitute half into d1 value is 7.5 and d2 value is 12 so we can cancel this 2 1 are 2 2 6 are 12 so 6 into 7.5 we are getting 45 centimeter square okay why we have taken square here because area is asked and almost all the times the area will be in square centimeters okay not only centimeter if it is meter also it should be in square okay square units okay okay moving to the next question here sixth one find the area of the rhombus whose side is five centimeters sorry i made a mistake here okay so this is five centimeter and whose altitude is 4.8 centimeter so altitude here means the height of the rhombus is 4.8 centimeter if one of its diagonal is eight meter long if its diagonal is eight meter long find the other find the length of other diagonal so as you can see the area of rhombus formula is half into d1 into d2 so one diagonal we are having that is 8 meter okay so another diagonal we want so sorry here this is not meter this is centimeter okay so it is 8 centimeter long find the length of the other diagonal so we have to find the length of the another diagonal so basic formula we are having that is area of rhombus is equals to base into height according to this question we are having base as well as we are having height so base into height so base value is given as 5 centimeter into height value is 4.8 so if we multiply both the cases we are going to get 24 centimeter square because why we have taken square here because you know that centimeter is square okay uh, area is in square units okay so this is 4 into uh, 5 into 4.8 is nothing but 24 centimeter square now we can apply the area of rhombus formula that is area of rhombus is equals to half into d1 into d2 so half value will be as it is into d1 value is given 8 centimeter 8 into d2 value is all, uh, d2 value we need to find out okay but we got area of rhombus that is 24 centimeter square so now, if we take this is 2 1s are 2, 2 4s are 8. It is remaining 4. If we take that 4 to this side, it will become divided by. So, 24 by 4, it is 4 1s are 4, 4 6 are 24. So, we got the answer as 6 centimeter. Okay. Why here there is no square? Because this is not area. We are finding the diagonal here. Okay. So, it is not in square. Okay, next question, as you can see, seventh one, the floor of a building consists of 3000 tiles. So, a, a floor of one building was having 3000 tiles, which are in rhombus shaped. Okay, and each of its diagonal are 45 centimeter and 30 centimeter in length. Find the total cost of polishing the floor if the cost per meter square is rupees 4. So, we need to find the cost for uh, if, if for 1 meter square of tiles, it is 4 rupees, then we need to find the total cost of 3000 tiles okay for that we need to find the area of that uh, rhombus okay if we find the area of that rhombus then we need to multiply with 4 and we will get the cost of painting that 3000 tiles so d1 is given that is 45 centimeter and d2 is given that is 30 centimeter area of one tile okay so we are finding the area of one rhombus that is half into d1 into d2 so half into d1 formula uh, d1 is 45 and d2 is 30 so two ones are and two fifteens are 30 we are having so 15 into 45 is 675 centimeter square so area of 3000 tiles so 675 into 3000 will be this much okay 20 25 with 30 centimeter okay so this is 20 lakhs 25,000 okay yes 20 lakhs and 25,000 centimeter square we are getting so they have already given you can see here centimeter we got so according to us the, according to the question they have given us in meter square for one meter square it is four rupees so this is in centimeter we need to find out this in meter okay so one meter square is equals to 10,000 centimeter square so 10,000 centimeter square means we are having uh, 20 lakh 25,000 we are having 20 lakh 25,000 okay what will be the meter square so we need to divide it by 10,000 so this two z three zeros and this three zeros got cancelled so directly we can find out 10 ones are 10 
10 twos are 20 okay again we are taking one zero here because next two number we are going to take again 10 twos are 20 5 is remaining 0. 0.5 okay so we got the answer 202.5 meter square so cost of 1 meter square was rupees 4 then the cost of 202.5 meter square means 202.5 into 4 we have to do so if we multiply all this we are going to get 810 rupees okay so next question you can see eighth one mohan wants to buy a trapezium shaped field okay so this is a trapezium shaped field its side along the river is parallel and twice the side along the road so it is along the one side is uh, along the side of the river and one side is along with the road side okay so if the area of this field is one ten thousand five hundred meters square okay they have already given us the area that is ten thousand five hundred meters square okay and the perpendicular distance perpendicular distance means the height of that trapezium is given it is nothing but between the two parallel side is hundred meters so height uh, a h height is equals to hundred meter find the length of the side along with the river so we need to find the length okay so h is given area is given let side along the river is equals to 2x meter okay side along the river because they have given twice the c its side along the river is parallel to and twice the side of the river so the side of the river is two times that of the road side okay so 2x meter we have taken and the side along the road we have taken it as x meter okay then area of trapezium formula we are having half into a plus b into height okay so area of trapezium already they have given which is equals to half into x plus 2x okay both the sides we have taken that is x plus 2x into height is 100 so if we cancel this two ones are two 250 is 100 we know that okay so x plus 2x is equals to 3x 3x into 50 is remaining so if you take this 50 to this side it will be like this okay 3x is equals to 10,500 divided by 50 0 and 0 is cancelled again if we divide this 5 ones are 5 5 twos are 10 5 ones are 5 and the 0 will be as it is so 3x is equals to 210 we got okay now if we find out the value of x 210 divided by 3 if you if this 3 is moved to this side it will be divided by 3 so 3 ones are 3 3 sevens are 21 and the 0 will be as it is so we got x is equals to 70 meter so we need to find out the value of x we got okay the road side uh, the side along the river is x meter which is equals to 70 meter now two times along the side of the river that is 2x so 2 into x is nothing but 2 into 70 which is equals to 140 meter okay so I hope all these four questions are being clear to you. If you are having any doubts regarding this, you can comment me down below. I'll be back with another video with the next questions and we will complete this exercise. So till then, stay tuned and stay connected. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.